Hey, Petey, how's it going? I'm freaking out. I just got tasked with designing and building a new data center, and I have no idea where to start. My boss recommended we use the engineering firm our company uses for office builds, but I still need to find an IT and cabling company. Then, I need to come up with a budget and keep the costs down, all by yesterday. I don't have time for this. I've got a network to keep running. You're kidding. I have to build a data center, too. Let's discuss it over lunch. Joe, two lunch specials, and put it on my tab. Man, you look a mess. What's up? My data center project couldn't be going worse. I can't get our IT consultant in sync with the facility engineers. We have no budget, we're way behind schedule, and my management keeps changing the requirements. I don't know what to do. My management is all over the map too, but our budget has come together nicely. We hired a single consultant that is a data center design expert in IT, facility, and cabling. They've been a pleasure to work with. Let me buy you lunch. Hey Joe, put it on my tab. Sorry I'm late. Tell me about your project. Well, our design documents and construction bids came back on schedule and on budget. We even cut orders for some long lead items, like our generator, UPSs, and the computer room air conditioners. Good for you. I wish I could say the same. We're stuck in the design phase because none of the firms we hired can agree on anything, and now we're considering new design options. We've got nothing on order and less than six months to move in. How come you're not having these problems? It's because the firm we hired really does provide a turnkey solution. First, they helped us establish our scope and budget from an IT and facility standpoint, but now we have them doing a lot more. They're also licensed architects and engineers, so they just converted their own conceptual plans over to sign and seal design documents, and they'll do the commissioning as well. On top of that, they are general contractors too, with lots of experience building tenant space computer rooms like ours. In the end, let them do all the rest too, including AV, communications, and wireless. We start construction next week. Congratulations, my friend. It sounds like you made a great choice. Let me buy you lunch this time. Put away your cash. Joe, put it on my tab. So my managers got so fed up with all the indecision and finger pointing that they canceled the project and decided to regroup and start over then I guess I feel kind of bad inviting you to our open house to show off our brand new data center. Unbelievable! So how did you finish your project while I'm right back at square one? It was all about choosing the right partner, the one I've been telling you about. PTS, besides having the experience and expertise to design and build our data center, they offered us the perfect vehicle for us to finance our project. PTS's smart open lease allowed us to get the exact data center we wanted with no upfront costs. PTS gave us six months to accumulate bills and apply them toward our previously approved open lease. By the time the six months was up, we had not paid for any capital expenditures for planning, design, construction management, or commissioning. We didn't even have to lay out any cash for any of our new IT infrastructure or our new facility infrastructure. We didn't even have to use cash for the labor. Now we've moved into our new data center. My management is happy, and the bead cutters have one nice, Heidi bill to pay each month. Wow, I'm going to give PTS a call right after I take care of this. Hey Joe, I want to buy my friend here some lunch and put it on my tab.